If you're the curious type, you probably approach everything without hesitation, and that includes animals you're not all that familiar with. Well, no matter how curious you are, never come close to any of the creatures we're about to show you. The first one is definitely the thing of my nightmares, so watch out for that. But before we get into the list, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our future videos. Number 10, Blobfish. We are sure that at first sight, this horrendous looking creature will have you screaming. The blobfish gets its name from its gelatinous flesh, which has a density slightly less than water. Looking like something that came out of an 80s sci-fi horror film, it actually does have a very practical approach, as it's able to float above the seafloor without having to swim or really apply any energy. At the depth that they're found, if they did have muscles or bones, they would get crushed due to the pressure, which is very high in the deepest parts of the ocean. But the practicality doesn't make it any less disturbing. It looks like an old deflated man who's given up on life. Its black eyes and a downturned mouth and nose give it a saddened look which makes you almost feel bad for it. It's weird, gross, and kind of makes you uncomfortable. It's an endangered species though, and it's found along the coast of South Africa. The poor creature was voted the ugliest animal on earth by the world's ugly animal society, which I totally knew was a real thing before making this video. Number 9, Naked Mole Rat. If you haven't seen this rat in real life, then you must have heard about it or seen it on the internet. Or if you're like me, remember the lovable Rufus from the cartoon Kim Possible. A special feature about them is that they live in communities with dozens of rats. The colony is led by one rat queen, kind of like bees, and being the only one that breeds, the name really suits her. Naked mole rats are also the longest living rodent, with a lifespan of 30 years. Another fun fact is that a molecule in them makes them cancer proof, which I guess is helpful considering they have no protection from the sun. But they don't seem to be getting much sun exposure, as they live in tunnels that can be miles long. Another quirky thing about them is that they can survive 18 minutes without oxygen. So if you're thinking about starting a breath holding competition with one, you might as well bow out now. Number 8, Wandering Spider. This spider may be number 8 on our list, but it's definitely number 1 in my nightmares. This extremely aggressive and deadly spider is found in the Amazon rainforest of several South American countries, including Brazil, Peru, Ecuador, and Venezuela. The Brazilian wandering spider is the most venomous arachnid in the world. Even the scientific name of the spider, Philonutria, means murderous in Greek. They are also found in many human-inhabited parts of Brazil. The spiders are called wandering spiders, as during the night, they prefer to crawl on the floor of the jungle looking for prey instead of building a web and trying to trap them. During the day, they hide in some parts of houses, under rocks, fallen logs, and as a result of this, they encounter humans a lot. Once disturbed, the Brazilian wandering spider will bite repeatedly, and they're also famous for showing a defensive display by lifting up their body on their hind legs. This spider was regarded as the world's most venomous spider, and its venom is potent enough to harm humans. An antidote has been found for them, but since 1996, 14 people were reported to have died from the bites of the spider. The venom also causes extreme pain and inflammation, as well as a loss of muscle control which might lead to respiratory paralysis and even death. I definitely hope I never cross paths with this one. Number 7, the cone snail. Imagine yourself scuba diving in the beautiful, crystal clear tropical waters of the Pacific Ocean. You may already know to avoid anemones because of their poisonous wispy tentacles. A sting from an anemone may hurt, but it probably won't kill you. What you may not realize is that an even more dangerous sea creature lurks just beneath the sand, waiting for the right moment to strike. The innocuous looking sea creature lives in a beautiful shell made of colorful specks of brown, black, and white that are often prized by beachcombers. As a matter of fact, I think I even brought one of these shells home for my last beach trip. However, their outer beauty hides a deadly inner secret. Once the nose of a cone snail senses food nearby, it deploys a sharp proboscis or a needle-like protrusion from its mouth. You may not even feel the sting of the proboscis because the attack is instantaneous and the venom injected into you has anesthetic or pain-killing properties. The lack of pain in your body is what makes the cone snail so deadly. You don't even know what hit you and probably won't seek treatment. If you disturb or frighten this pretty little thing, you could die a very quick death and hardly feel any pain. And although that might sound more attractive than a slow, painful death, trust me, you do not want to be on the wrong side of this shell. Number 6, Piranhas. Piranhas are the most feared predator of the Amazon rainforest. They're freshwater fish known for their powerful jaws and razor-sharp teeth. 
They have one of the strongest bites among bony fishes, and the black piranha's bite is one of the most forceful bites among vertebrates overall. The bite of a piranha can easily tear through all flesh, including that of a human. They primarily feed on fishes, insect, algae, and seeds, so a group attack from piranhas is rare as they tend to be more opportunistic hunters, preferring to scavenge food from corpses of already dead animals. But during the starving period, or when provoked by humans or other animals, they attack in a group. A group of hungry piranhas will attack almost anything. Interestingly, a group of piranhas could strip the flesh from even a large mammal within minutes. The sharp, triangular teeth and powerful jaws aid them in such an attack. Piranha attacks on humans are very rare. However, if food is scarce, I might want to stay out of the water. Number 5. Amazonian Centipede Also known as the giant yellow leg centipede, the Amazonian giant centipede is found in various places in South America. It is one of the largest species of centipedes in the world and is known to be very aggressive. This centipede can grow up to 10 to 12 inches long and is another fierce predator in the Amazon, feeding on anything it can kill. And yes, I mean anything. From insects, tarantulas, small birds, lizards, frogs, mice, small snakes, and even bats. They coil their bodies around their prey almost like a snake, eating it while it's still alive. The centipede's primary weapons for killing prey are a pair of modified legs called forcipules. The centipede uses these modified legs to penetrate the body of the victim and inject a highly toxic venom into the bloodstream. Humans can't be eaten, but if they were to get bitten, the Amazonian giant centipede can cause pain, chills, fever, and weakness. A four-year-old child was reported to have been killed by this centipede's venom. The killer creatures can even climb the ceilings of caves where they hold and manipulate their prey like bats with only a few legs attached to the ceiling. This is just another example of how nature can be beautiful and terrifying all at the same time, especially in the Amazon. Number 4. The Giant African Land Snail The giant African land snail is the largest species of snail found on land and generally grow to about 20 centimeters in length. In the areas of the world where it's found, the giant land snail is generally seen as a pest as these snails will eat almost anything vegetarian, and they've been proven to be quite destructive around crops and wildflowers. It's native to the forests of East Africa, but it has been introduced into Asia, the Caribbean, and a number of islands in both the Pacific and Indian Oceans. Now we know what you're thinking, what could a snail possibly do to you that would make you turn tail and run? Well we're getting into that right now. The giant African land snail are known to carry parasites that can transmit meningitis into humans. A scary thought, especially coupled with the fact that they are kept as pets in some parts of the world. Number 3. Komodo Dragon if you think lizards and turtles might be bizarre looking reptiles, the creature at number 3 will definitely have you stunned. The Komodo dragon is absolutely majestic and is the largest living lizard in the world. Growing up to 3 meters long and weighing 150 pounds or more, these incredible creatures don't need flight or fire to be worthy of our awe and admiration. Their most fascinating feature is that they eat 80% of their weight in just one sitting. That is 120 pounds on average in a single meal. Still less than what a normal American eats in snack time though, but that's a topic for another video. Originally from Australia, they can be commonly found in Indonesia. Komodo dragons love to fight each other, but when desperately hungry, they have even been known to feast on humans. If you're ever unfortunate enough to be attacked by a Komodo dragon, there's a narrow chance you'll survive it. Number 2. Purple Frog This amphibian is one of the most weirdest species in the world. It was discovered not long ago. It made itself known to a man just 17 years ago in 2003. It was found in the Western Ghats, also known as the Siadri Mountains in India. The purple frog looks so weird you might feel uncomfortable just seeing it with your own eyes. Good thing though is that they mostly stay in the soil throughout the year and only come out for a few weeks for the purposes of breeding. Its almost non-existent yellow eyes are flashy enough to make you feel sick, and its nose is one of its most peculiar features. Just touching it could be one of the most terrifying moments of your life, and finding these in neighborhood parks would not be memorable at all and can totally ruin your evening. And number one on our list, the hagfish. At the bottom of the ocean, a bizarre looking fish known as the hagfish is found. It's said to be so ancient that it hasn't changed for around 300 million years. It's found near the ocean floor in the deepest parts. Its body is made up of velvet smooth skin with no scales, and it has a skull with no spine. Its wrinkled skin might look disgusting to you, but the weirdest feature of the hagfish is definitely its mouth. 
It looks like something straight out of an alien movie. Its jawless mouth is made for mincing up dead bodies of fish lying on the ocean floor. Several teeth are packed on two bony plates, which are enough to rip the flesh off the dead fish, and are shoved down its throat that's also full of teeth. And if you think that wasn't enough, the hagfish has one nostril with which it picks up the sweet scent of death. As if you needed another reason to be afraid of the ocean. So, that was our list. Which of these animals did you find the most disturbing? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe to our channel. And ring the bell so you don't miss any of our latest videos.